What's up, Capricorn? It's your girl, Tanya, and welcome to Katora Tarot. Guys, please like, share, and comment. Please subscribe to the channel. Anything you'd like to know about me and this channel will be down in the description below. Also, I do this for entertainment purpose only, so please take what resonates and leave the rest behind. i also like you to know that no weapon formed against me shall never, ever, ever prosper. I am protected by the Most High God and my team of spiritual warriors of the highest light. My ancestors don't play about me, so please, for your safety, don't even try it. On that note, I'd like to call in your warriors, my warriors, and the Most High God to this reading. So I could get clear, accurate channel messages, please and thank you. What up, my fellow Capricorns? What's going on? What's good? What y'all doing out there? It's a lot, you know, with this Pluto in, 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 in Capricorn to, you know. We don't go and end this 16 year cycle. I don't know about you. We know, AKA villain era. We realizing we've been people pleasing for way too fucking long and giving our powers and our shit to other people way too long. And we taking on our powers and everything that's us back. We calling that shit in. Like, then you like, damn, I allow this shit to happen this long? Who, me, Cappy? <laughs> Yeah, you like, uh-uh, not no more. Finally, right? <laughs> Let's see what Spirit got for us, Cappy. What do you have for Iron the Collector? That's way too much. Do you? So we got the beach. And well, so the beach. I mean, I don't know about you, I love the beach. I love going to the beach. Oh, man, I've seen so much. One time, oh, my God. One time, my grandmother, may she rest in peace, after we left the, um, you know, funeral and everything like that, some of me and my cousin, we decided to go to the beach and just, you know, oh, my God, that night, I saw all my ancestors just surrounding us from the sea. You're looking up in the sky, you just see all the ancestors guys and everything just in a circle looking down on me the shit was so profound i would never forget that day as long as i live y'all it was just i was in ooh and i ah, didn't matter what direction i turned it was a big circle around me in the sky with ancestors guys just around us i felt all my my ancestors and my grandmother and then my mama too presence just like right there like we got you baby girl you're about to go on your life is about to change in ways you have <laughs> no idea of, but for the good, for the better. They ain't lying. I'm up here reading, reading now. <laughs> I'm tapped in like a, whoa. But yeah, the beach. Maybe you need to go to the beach. I mean, I need to go to the beach. Last time I've been on the beach was like a month ago. <laughs> oh, we had dance and celebrate. What I was just saying. Our life about to change for the best. You may be getting muse on um, some type of information through um, music and dancing. And look, Gaia nurturing. Okay, we we that you need to go tap into Gaia. You being nurtured like a motherfucker. You got a lot of soldiers around you. I was just saying my my um. What happened to me a few years ago now, I'm seeing it on a whole different scale. You got a lot coming in for you. It's time for you to celebrate, dance, and have a good old time. I feel like it's been a long time coming. You literally, with Gaia, you literally watch everybody win. And you was happy for them. And now it's your turn to celebrate. It, but I don't see that much people as I see here that's celebrating for you. I literally could count on one hand what I see. And that's okay. Because you got your spiritual team of the highest light. You, don't, you realize 
finally on this journey coming as far as you are right here right now today in this moment in this time in this space that you don't need none of them outside of you everything you need and desire is within you anything outside of you is just bonus and you don't need them to celebrate you, you celebrate your damn self because for a very 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 long time you've been people pleasing yeah, you've been people pleasing. And now it's time for you to celebrate. It's, it's, it's time, yeah. Because look, you was, you, you, they furious with you. Somebody furious with you because for a while, yeah, somebody's very offended by your happiness. They mad that you this you in your winning season, literally. They mad. You got somebody that's pissed off. At least three people. It could be more, but I'm seeing three. They don't want you in the celebration mood. You need to go to the beach and I don't know, give an offering or something. I don't know, but go take a a a a, a, a go. Take a spiritual bath. Something. You got somebody pissed off. You got multiple people pissed off with you. I guess because you ain't taking their shit no more. You talking your truth. And ain't motherfuckers who's in the dark doing some bullshit. They don't never like to hear when somebody come out and start talking the truth about their dark secret when they ain't giving it out. But they like to talk shit about everybody else. But they, you know, they like to dish it and, and, and don't like to take it. When it, when it. when the table turns, now they got to um, take the bullshit. They don't like it. They don't like how it feels. They are very uncomfortable with you right now. And you don't give a fuck. You over here dancing and enjoying your winning season. Real talk. That sounds like a them problem and not a you problem. It don't sound like a you problem. It sounds like a them problem. They, they real upset with you. You ain't worried. Look, nature's all, you got all the elements on your side. Like, seriously. They cheering you on. That's what I'm saying. You don't need these, these fake ass people outside of you to cheer you on and celebrate you. You got, a, you got Gaia out here celebrating you with all the elements. You got earth, wind, fire. You got all of them celebrating you. You got ether celebrating you. And these motherfuckers mad as fuck because they thought they had you because you was people pleasing these people for so long, longer than you needed to, you know? Some, you was people pleasing them for a very, 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 very long time, and some, just too long enough, you know? I feel like you met somebody new or some people new, and yeah, you was on your people pleasing journey, but you're no longer on that shit no more, and they pissed off because, like, what the fuck? What they saw with you was the illusion of what they wanted from you. You feel me? You had all this this light coming out of you, and they just was taking, taking, taking. And you was like, here, take that, take that, take that. Not not in a ditty kind of way, though, but. <laughs> but seriously, though, no, five, one, three, two, well, let me get serious. But seriously, um, you're no longer doing that. And they is pissed the fuck off. Because they feel like they have no control over you. And you very unbothered. Look at you. You just dancing, celebrating you. You're like, oh, well, again, that's not like a you problem and not a me problem. <laughs> that's what I'm getting. Like, you just, you know, go get a wash off. Go to the beach. Dive in deep. Look, they wishing you that you get sick and all. Get the fuck out of here. This ain't for you. This ain't for you at all. You over here relaxing. Reading a book, journaling. You you not this is what they want for you. But that's not happening. This is what's happening. You're relaxing. Cause you, you you're tired. You just came from dancing. So now you just relaxing. You feel me? You came from the beach enjoying, you got your little spiritual bath, all that. You went to the ocean, got washed off and everything. You meditated and everything. You celebrating you for achieving all that you achieving, how far you came. And now you're just relaxing. And these motherfuckers out here, 
I'm seeing it two ways. They wanted you to be ill, but now they're ill. Everything they wanted for you is not happening to them, and they pissed the fuck off. They like how uh, God, your ancestors, your spiritual team of the highest light. That's how they pissed off with you. Yeah, they want you sick and codependent on them is what I'm hearing. And that's not happening. That's not happening whatsoever. Look, they wanted you really sick, infinity sick. This is an eight. This is infinity. 35 reduced to an eight. They wanted you to forever be sick, forever be, you know, dependent on the doctors and everything. Everything to keep you in this bed. But that's not what's happening. Look at you. You like very unbothered. I'm getting a very unbothered, you know, energy from you, Capricorn. You just relaxing and shit. You just had a great outdoor experience, and now you coming in, relaxing. You ate some food, took your bath, and now you laying down with a book and chilling. You know, such an earth sign, such an app. You, oh, um, Capricorn. You, they want you to be down and out. Yeah, you over here celebrating you by just relaxing. 69, when you reduce all the numbers, you getting a three. That's celebrating you. That's relaxing. That's that's everything you. you. You're not worried about them people. You've been there, done that, and you realize that you've been doing way too much or way too long for some of these people. And if they only had you for a short period of time, is they fucking lost. You realize just before it gets any uh, further with you people pleasing or giving too, way too much of, of a fuck for them, giving them your, way too much of you and not getting the return, that back in return, you start realizing quicker with these new people in your life. You're like, Ugh! you put a stop on that shit, whether it's friends, family, whoever. Co-workers, it doesn't matter. You realize, oh, I see what this is. I ain't repeating them off the hamster wheel. We not going through this bullshit again. I'm tired, says Capricorn. And you pulled your shit back and you went the other way. And you did just right. Yeah, so all they wanted this for you, they mad because nothing is happening. Everything they wish for you is not happening to them. Yeah. You, you, you mean, you're celebrating. You're being celebrated. You got all the elements out here celebrating you. You got the spirit world celebrating you, protecting you, guiding you. You have nothing, absolutely nothing to worry about. Even when it feels like or look like, man, shit ain't going right, this, that, and the third. Oh, don't worry about that. Everything is happening just the way it needs to happen. Give it a couple months to you. You're going to be in a whole different Mind space, head space, whole different life. It's like I'm seeing a Cinderella story. I'm seeing rags to riches. So a lot of y'all Capricorns out there, y'all coming into a lot of money is what I'm hearing. You don't have to worry about your bank account ever going on red ever again. You also a giver. So, and you, wow. Yeah, you a giver. And you were giving back to the less fortunate. I see you traveling and celebrating other people and other cultures and giving back to them. Mm-hmm. And you're being guided and protected to do this. So as much as it's given, much is being received. And you're about to show that, you know, they made the right choice choosing you. Yeah. Because you're not only... All this money I'm seeing, I'm seeing a lot of green leaves, a lot of money. You're not selfish, you're, you know, you, you take care of you. And if you have kids or whoever is close-knit to you, you're taking care of them too. And then you're also going out and looking to where you're being guided to, to give back. So you're not a selfish person at all. And this is having these motherfuckers furious fuck because they can't even get what you got. They want whatever it is that you're getting from the spirit world, what you're getting from nature, what you're getting from the world, the universe. They want some of that, and they're they not connected. They can't get shit 
And they mad. They thought whatever they did to you will have you down and out, sick and bed bound is what I'm hearing. And nope, it's happening to them. You're literally, you know, reading maps and shit and saying, okay, I'm going to go to this country and I'm going to go, you know, celebrate their culture and learn their culture and their ways of stuff and give back to them. You're not worried about these motherfuckers over here. You know, you're being guided by the spirit world, you know. You you go to the even when you go to the um beach, you meditate on the beach, you 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 connect into all the elements, you're one with all the elements. This is your time, this is your season. You don't you don't got shit to worry about, Capricorn. Understand everything is in divine order. Like these motherfuckers done left you a, a, a bathtub of dirty shit to clean up. Don't don't worry. Your spiritual team is on it, so that's why your life may look like, what the fuck, you know? But it's getting cleaned up quicker than you could do it yourself, and you're not doing it yourself. You got the whole spirit world. You got Guy and all them working for you and, you know, doing a lot of greatness in the background, clearing out all kinds of paths and shit just for you. It's your time. It's your season. And if you don't need nobody outside of you to celebrate you. You got... The spirit world, you got the universe celebrating you. You 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 literally learning different languages and stuff for these countries you're about to visit. You're about to build, you know, all kinds of stuff. I'm seeing houses, organization in different parts of the world because of you. Because you celebrated everybody else. And again, I'm getting a sense when it came time for you to celebrate. You can't see but one, two, maybe three people celebrating you. But you done did, the much, as much as you done did for people, it's, you're shocked by the number on one hand that's really happy for you. And that's okay. That's okay. That's why you cut them motherfuckers off. Because they can't come, with, come where you going, where, you know, the most high is sending you. You feel me? They can't enjoy all this greatness that's coming to you. You're literally learning different languages and shit, looking at books and shit, catalogs on what people, tradition is, what they eat, what they don't eat, how they greet somebody. You know, like in China, they say, what? Or Japan, they say, konnichiwa. You know, shit like that. So you're learning all different language and how to be manageable. You're not worried about these motherfuckers who try to get you sick. Maybe once upon a time you were sick to the point you were in the bed written. But you being who you are and still being happy for other people, you're no longer there. You're out here dancing, you know, going to the, the ocean, getting washed off. Anything that doesn't serve you, you want, that shit got washed away. Quick, fast, in a hurry. You feel me? And now you're able, since you washed all that bullshit off of you, you feel me? You're not tapping in with these people no more. You're not giving them your energy, your powers, your ability, your thought pattern, nothing. You ain't helping them out with nothing. You feel me? That brought you to your celebration era. You're celebrating. You're doing everything that's, you know, for you. And you got the backing of the spirit world, the universe, backing you a billion fold. Like, the shit you're about to do in the next few months hasn't even been heard of. Real talk. And you're just doing what you're told. Relax. That's all you're doing is relaxing. And they don't understand that because they're trying to throw all kinds of bullshit illness your way for you to be, you know, sick and bounded. And that's not happening. That will never happen. And your team ain't going to, excuse me, ain't allow it to happen. So they could continue being mad and angry and all like that. Oh, well, that again, that sounds like a day problem, you know, and not a you problem. Make them time there with them jealous, bad-minded self. We got don't allow negative emotion to fasten, to fist faster. If you are feeling frustrated, angry, or hurt, for example, just acknowledge that instead of fighting your feelings, go with them and work with them. Then true healing can really begin. And you realize that. Why be upset? Why be upset? You taught back your motherfucking power and you went through it. You did. You went through it. And now you're here relaxing. 
learning different things, different ways. You, you, you don't got nothing to worry about. <laughs> Seriously. They tried. They did. And they didn't succeed. Oh, well. <laughs> That's what I have for you, Cappy. Enjoy your winning season. Because it's not going to end no time soon. I, maybe for the rest of your own lifetime. Because Pluto... Being in Capricorn, you it will never happen again in this lifetime, ever. Just you know, just hold on. A little rough and stuff for the next two months. You know, when is it? November nineteenth is when they leave your sign forever. You don't got nothing to worry about. When they came in your sign, was it what? Oh eight, something I don't remember, but it's your time. It's your season on so many level where, wherever it's numerology it's your time your season whether it's astrology it's your time your season whether them go to a jujuman or a orbiaman or a black man whatever it is it's all saying oh uh, you can't do nothing it's this person's time no matter what you try it's going to return back to you so yeah they mad and you ain't you you chilling you up here relaxing and celebrating you it's nothing else to say <laughs> Oh, well. <laughs> and that's what I have for you, Cappy. Please like, share, and comment. Please subscribe to the channel. I'd like to thank you, your warriors, my warriors, and the Most High God for this reading. You have a blessed day, night, morning, evening, whenever you see this message. It will be for you. All right.